Hey, hey, we've got a 1966 Nova Super Sport. It's a genuine born Super Sport, but this car has gone through a complete rotisserie restoration around 2019. There's only about 1,300 miles since it was finished. It has a 350 motor, a nice turbo 350 automatic, upgraded suspension, disc brakes, got bucket seats, console, as beautiful underneath as it is on top. Go to volocars.com. That's where you can catch the price tag on about 200 collector vehicles we have for sale. And each one of them also has a monthly finance payment. So you can afford uh, to buy this car or one of the cars on our website. But for right now, join me. Let's go for a spin. Yeah, that's a real nice one and buzz around the shop. All the guys that have worked on it and serviced it and cleaned it all said it's a really nice car. So I'm looking at a beautiful finish. I mean, it's like yellow glass. It's straight, fits up nicely, square. Sides of the car, absolutely straight. All one color yellow. For some reason, I get yellow cars and doors are mismatched, uh, but this is all one shade of yellow. Clean all along the bottom, smooth. Let's see how this door opens. Opened up real easily, shut like a new car, no rattles. The roof, sail panels, all this absolutely really clean. <clears throat> I've walked around this car a few times and it looks good, but now that I'm really looking at it, I'm extra impressed. I really am. This is one of the exceptional cars from what I see so far. Absolutely straight. I'm not even finding a flaw. Just to be clear, doesn't mean there isn't one. Like here's a little touch up. They did a really nice job of touching it up. This is all clean. Look at the body lines. Just real nice. Well, that wiped off. Let's see how this door does. That opens so easily. Shut like a new car. Mirror's a little wobbly. It needs to be tightened up. So the body and paint finish looks to be amazing. Uh, I think it's called Lemonwood Yellow. I just looked it up five minutes ago and I already forgot, but I think it's Lemonwood Yellow. The color it was born. Windshield is new. All the trim, the gasket looks excellent. The wiper arms are shiny. Look at the front of the car. Sparkling bumper, the grill, the trim. All this looks to be in really great shape. 327 cross flag emblems sparkle. The rocker moldings are straight and shiny. Vent window glass is new. The side glass is real good original. Windows roll up like a hot knife through butter, just super easy. This trim here is straight and shiny. It's probably been replaced. New door handles. The back window was replaced. That's new. Trim is all buffed and polished. Super Sport. Super Sport tail panel. All this stuff is in excellent shape. Everything fits nice to the car, too. I, I really, I, I would keep this myself. Personally, it's that nice of a car. So they gave the wheels a bit of a stagger. They're 16 inch in back, 15s in front, a little bit wider, uh, torque thrust polished wheels with obviously radial tires. There's a nice, nice little stance. It is a bow tie mirror. So there you have it. Good looking car so far. I think the uh, inside will impress you too. This Nova continues to impress. Even smells clean, believe it or not, when I open the trunk. Look how smooth this painted, just slick as can be, including the jam, the new weather strip. Very clean, tidy, gray and white spatter finish. Look how the floor is carpeted with a nice bound edge mat, upholstered panel, uh, front and back. There's another panel back here as well. So really nice, clean, fresh, tidy uh, trunk compartment. If you're interested in finding out as new arrivals arrive, text the word new, N-E-W, to 844-592-2431. The door jams are painted slick on this car. Weather strips are in real good shape. On this side over here, passenger door, the edge of the rubber is a little tattered. The inside trim is painted. Even up by the hinges is painted real nice. Door panels look all new, including the armrests, the window cranks, the handles. 
Yeah, this is what I was talking about. All the metal painted up real nicely. The whole instrument panel as tidy as can be. 1,131 miles since the restoration. I just removed the cigarette lighter and put a couple USB ports that you know, charge your phone in that. Padded dash looks new. Has the nicely installed custom gauges. Heater control panels, nice and clean. It's got a hidden Kenwood stereo working light. This is our inspection sheet. We'll go with the car. If you buy it, you'll get this. Three pages have been filled out already. The last page gets filled out. It gets a second inspection before the car leaves. This car is just so nice. Um, here's some extra touch-up paint. A little bag of some touch-up. Here's a, a little can of the paint. Kick panels are tidy. The carpets fit without wrinkles. Uh, the bucket seats, I'm, I can tell you, they're rebuilt. They're nice and firm. The cushions are real nice. The upholstery is new. Very nice center console. Doesn't look brand new, but it looks real good. You got GM seat belts in the front. You see how nice the seat is. There's no wrinkles. Look how nice it fits. The back's real nice. And everything back here is just as good. The upholstery fits real nice. The side panels, window cranks look new. Um, I'm assuming there's some speakers underneath the rear shelf. There's some custom trim going on. Headliner, tight as a drum. It all looks new. Dome light works. New matching visors. Uh, must be a hands-free stereo. It's got the little microphone. And I think also somewhere... There's a cord, there's a remote in there for the stereo, but there's a cord somewhere for auxiliary, I think, hanging underneath there. And then the steering wheel in real nice shape, and I didn't notice the tachometer. It's like a vintage style uh, tachometer there. Really nice, clean car throughout. Got a buy it now button on our website. See something you like, that just gets it locked in if you hit the button. Before someone else beats you to it, that's a that's a horrible feeling. I'm told it's a crate 350. I don't know that for a fact, but it is an excellent running 350 motor, uh, aluminum intake, Edelbrock car with electric choke. There's an MSD ignition hiding in the back, and that is the dual snorkel air cleaner that you'll see on the L79 Nova. It's dressed up with these nice pinned aluminum valve covers. You can see the engine bay, all painted real clean. Hardware, hinges, nuts, bolts, hoses, and brackets. Everything looks really good. Got Ultima battery. Um, <clears throat> all the way up front here is a nice mesh screen over the radiator. There's an oil cooler for the transmission. This has been painted to match the radiator. It looks like stainless hardware is used all over the place. Stainless steel radiator hoses, upper and lower, aluminum pulley, chrome alternator hiding way down there. Got both horns, washer bottles hooked up. Now look at this detail. Look at these nice little brackets that hold the wiring and the washer hose. That's the type of build this car is. It's meticulous. Power brakes with a dual reservoir. That's an upgrade. And then underneath the hood's painted real nice. Has the hood insulation pads. Yeah, I'm really impressed with this car. Caleb's going to take you for a drive, see if uh, that's just as impressive. All right, we got this gorgeous Nova. Uh, we're taking her around the block, going to show you how she drives. Just got this one in uh, all of yesterday, I think, so guys up at the shop they took it out for a test drive to make sure everything's solid on it so that I can take it out uh, so I don't have all the specs yet but by, t by the time the video goes up you guys will see this uh, and we'll have all the deets on it but super nice car I'd call it a cream puff yeah, it's just very solid very nicely put together great acceleration Power brakes feel really good. Steering's nice and tight. 
She sounds killer too. Let's see what she's got though. I feel like it'll be a little bit of fun. Oh yeah. Nice and torquey all the way through. Accelerates beautifully. We're cruising right now. It's super solid. Tracks really nice. Yeah, I like this one. A little bit more simple, you know. You got the radio delete. We got some nice gauges going on, but you don't need a radio when a car sounds like this. Turn signals work and they cancel. Puts you back in the seat a little bit. I like it. So as I said, this was a rotisserie restoration. That means everything was removed from the bottom of the car and it was the body, the shell was literally flipped on a rotisserie. That way you can work on the bottom. Uh, it looks as nice as the top. Perfectly clean metal, all painted the same color. It has some nice upgrades. Up front is a CPP uh, sports sus uh, suspension. It has a heavy duty uh, cross member tubular control arms, upper and lowers, uh, custom drop spindles, heavier duty sway bar, all the steering's new. They've welded in frame connectors from front to back. It prevents this little Nova from twisting, and it looks like the factory put them in. They're part of the structure. They're painted yellow. It looks like that's how it was born. In back, the rear suspension's all new, the springs, the bushings. Uh, adjustable gas shocks, <clears throat> fuel systems all new, the tank, the straps, the sending unit, the fuel lines, brake system completely redone, rebuilt drums, new brake lines, e-brakes hooked up, converted to disc in the front, very neatly installed dual exhaust system. The pipes just are peeking out behind the tires there. There's a crossover pipe, accelerator mufflers, you look up at the motor, it's nice and fresh. The starter looks new. Turbo 350 automatic. This would have been a two-speed power glide originally. Um, rebuilt drive shaft goes back to a 10-bolt rear end. Underneath this car is like brand new. I'm telling you, this is one of the exceptional ones. I'm very proud of this car. Go to volocars.com. Click that Buy It Now button if you're even remotely interested. That'll just lock it in for you. Also, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click the bell icon. You'll be notified as the videos are posted. Salesmen can help with all your questions, including how to get this delivered, how to get it financed. Thanks for watching.